It's a, it's a school like any other school. It's a school where children come to learn Perfect. and grow and develop their skills so that they can reach the goals that they have for themselves. We don't work here to fix kids or to cure kids. We work here to give them the tools that they need and want in order to be successful in achieving their goals. Here we have David and David is doing the Scholastic and we've been doing this for a number of years and he is a pro at it. How it keeps his workspace neat, just like Bobby, and they're always on point. Yeah. Always wait. on point. Yeah, awesome work, David. And our job and our responsibility and our role as teachers, it's to prepare them for the daily living skills, functional skills that carry them beyond high school beyond post high school. Your change will be 75 cents and back. Two. Perfect. And you push time cook. That was great. It's something that's magical actually. This is where dress rehearsal is. And then the goal and the hope is to get them prepared for the real world. My job is to explain to a parent who is in a situation with their child that we can be of help. Um, and they don't always hear that from schools. They've, they have heard over and over, we can't be of help. Your child is an issue. Your child has a problem that we can't serve. At Ivy Mount, we struggle very hard to be able to serve the needs of students who are not able to be served in other places. So many of our students love to do artwork and I think it's displayed all over our school and it's so wonderful to be able to share with everybody. And I think also it just shows a lot of respect to our students that they can see their work hanging all over the walls. And that's what's really important to us is to create a respectful culture and among each other as staff and then certainly with our families and our children. We have had so much success with students. We have one little boy who graduated last year from second grade. He had been with us for two years and he um, said to us that he struggled with the transition to leave Maddox and to go to another school and he said that Maddox was the first school where he had ever made a friend. The teachers um, create excitement in the children and if you don't have excited and enthusiastic teachers you're not going to have enthusiastic learners. And I think that says it all. We actually have some students that use, keep these eye touches with them um, so that they can listen to their music, you know, at any time. Um, and it's a, the nice thing about um, all this technology is that it's not stigmatizing in any way. It's perfectly natural and typical to see um, somebody walking down the street with headphones in, listening to music, playing games. Um, so a lot of those um, skills we can teach uh, are no longer uh, really drawing any extra attention to our students, but it's helping them to be successful. Our Young Adult Center provides a transition for our students from school to employment. In all of our programs, students receive therapeutic, academic, social, and life skills instruction. Community-based instruction, recreational activities, career development, and transition services are all important parts of helping our students to achieve their highest level of independence. All our models and teaching strategies are evidence-based so that we can be sure the way we are working with students is effective. It is small enough to have everybody working together too and the students can like easily navigate because it's just like three or four um, rooms that they need to go to. Green means? Yeah. yeah. My favorite part of Ivy Mount is walking into the classrooms. Any classroom you go into, the students are engaged, the staff are happy and excited. And the, you can just see the learning and growing that's happening in the classrooms. My favorite part of the day at Ivy Mount is arrival. Uh, the kids come out of the buses, they're happy to be here, we've got a million people who say hello to them. Being a physical education teacher, you get to have all the classes, so I get to know all the different programs and all the different kids. Yeah, Morning, David. It's a wonderful, wonderful time of the day at Ivy Mount. <laughs> I had one 
young lady who was just turned 13. It was her first meeting. We had done the interview, prepped for it. And I just, you know, went before the meeting. I previewed with her what we were going to do. She came into the meeting and she led the entire meeting, which is really the goal for our, all of our students for that self determination that they need to become as independent as possible as adults. It was incredible. Well, I got I'm really proud of the fact that. I have such unbelievable staff at the school that have been so willing to spend so much time learning and thinking um, and growing uh, with all the initiatives that we've put together and they've stuck with it and they get it and um, I'm most proud of them. I'm a mom of two kids with a special needs so I am very um, up on what is good and what is bad in terms of staffing and support and I have never seen staff so committed so dedicated, um, who love to be with the kids and think about them all the time and are constantly coming up with um, you know, new ideas to help a student be more successful. Parents are very wide-eyed and amazed when they finish a tour and go, there's no other place that does this. Um, it makes me feel really good when parents out of the blue like write us notes and uh, email us throughout the day like my son did this at home and like he must have learned it at IML. You get to go home at the end of the day knowing that in my program but in this building there are over 200 students that are better off for having been in this building. I have this saying that you never work a day in your life if you enjoy what you do and when I see the success of these students every single day there's never a Monday for me it's always a Friday we have a ball at what we do, the entire Vogue team and all the teachers. And so, it's exciting, it's exciting. Our families always tell us that not only have we made such a difference for their children in feeling confident and successful, but we have changed their family's life because children are happy coming to school and parents are not sitting by the phone every day worried that the phone is gonna ring and they have to pick up their child from school. There's no other place like I'm not really.